All right, here we go. Okay. Ready? Blah. Blah, blah. You're great. Blah. You're about to cry. Magic fingers. We don't like people. We want to be out in the woods alone. Yeah, exactly. <laughs> we are Mark and Catherine Vorkapich. And this is our moving story. Oh, well, it's the first family in the homestead. It's been kind of interesting because we were like, oh, well, you know, we're the uh, guinea pigs is what we were thinking. And next thing you know, everybody started calling us the pioneers, which I thought was pretty cool. Mm -hmm. Personally, I like to call us the OGs. <laughs> so in May of 2020, we were in Vero Beach, Florida, and we found the website for Reynolds and thought that it looked too good to be true. <laughs> so we threw our three kids in the car, drove here to Greensboro and spent four days and just absolutely fell in love with it. What we envisioned is a legacy property. Um, to us, that means a place where we could have our cousins, our aunts, uncles, family members, when we become grandparents, that we can have our grandchildren here um, and really add to it, keep expanding um, the space to do that. We knew that we needed to have a place for our parents to both either visit or even stay. Uh, so we built a cottage and uh, it's been really great for connecting our families together on a regular basis and celebrating holidays and enjoying time together as an as a extended family. In moving out here, having these kids off their cell phones and off of technology, I can't tell you how much that has meant to our family. Yeah, we just love seeing them have the opportunity on any given day to ride their side-by-sides through the trails and to jump in the lake and swim in the pool and kayak and mountain bike. And they just have so many opportunities to do these things on a daily basis. Since I started obstacle course racing a few years ago, I've just found that living out here at the homesteads gives me all sorts of fun opportunities to run or I can throw a spear out in the backyard or climb a rope up a tree and I may not look like a total crazy person out here doing that, um, but I just love the opportunity to have so much land and so much space to be creative um, for myself and for the kids. I would like to say that in our vision process, throughout our marriage, Mark has always talked about creating an altar and something for your family that creates traditions and memories and that is something that lives on with your family. So the vi vision began with collecting input from everyone in the family, but then saying, how can we really make this the legacy that we talked about where generations and generations would say, I want to live there. And um, we did it. Mm-hmm.